Bombardier is making big news here in Las Vegas at the NBA show with the unveiling of the world's largest purpose-built business jet. The Global 7000 is a clean sheet, $72.8 million ultra long range jet featuring a four zone cabin. The aircraft is still undergoing extensive testing and this is the fourth out of five flight test vehicles. We're really excited to be here uh, in Las Vegas uh, for NBAA. Uh, especially excited to have FTV4 right behind me. We have the largest business aircraft uh, available on the market. And what that does for us is it, it helps us provide all the amenities and all the service that we need as far as the aircraft interior. Uh, but also having a real business jet uh, is actually allowing us access into airports uh, and into certain areas where commercial airplanes of that size wouldn't be allowed to. Uh, because of all the new technologies that we have on the airplane, where to be engine performance, our, uh, our brand new wing, uh, so a lot of great features that allows us uh, full access into many areas of the world uh, where our customers uh, typically travel. In the past few months, we've had an opportunity to enter FTV4 and FTV3 as well into the flight test program. FTV4 behind me will have a real purpose in testing all the comfort and all the amenities that we have for our customers. So we're going to do a lot of validation, where it be sound survey, air circulation, air quality, uh, pressure, altitude, and so on. Bombardier is aiming for entry into service in the second half of 2018 and has already begun the airframe assembly of eight customer Global 7000s at its Toronto facility. The aircraft will then move on to Bombardier's Interior Completion Center in Montreal. What we currently have are first five customer cabin interiors that are being built in our center of excellence, uh, our facility in Montreal. Uh, we've got a great state-of-the-art uh, facility over there with a lot of brand new uh, high technology equipment where we can combine the excellent workmanship and partisanship that our people bring coming from the 6000, but at the same time a lot of new technology that we can leverage uh, and use to be a little bit more precise and accurate in how we build uh, our interiors.